In this tutorial, I'd like to show you how to create a tilt shift look with Depth Blur. Depth Blur is part of the FX Factory Pro suite of plugins. I'm in Final Cut Pro 10, but this effect also works in Motion, Adobe After Effects, and Premiere Pro as well. You can find it in the Effects Browser under FX Factory Pro in the Blur category. I'll drag it to the clip on my timeline. I want to create a tilt shift effect. This is a look that's popular these days in video and even in feature films. It's often used to simulate a miniature scene with its shallow depth of field and selective focus. Depth Blur makes this easy. First, you'll notice the on-screen control that allows you to position the effect and a drop-down menu where you can choose a preset. I'll choose Tilt Shift. In the parameters, the shape drop-down allows you to choose either a bar, an oval, or a gradient. I'll choose bar because it's best for simulating tilt shift and narrow depth of field. You can adjust the amount and size of the effect easily with the sliders. I'll move the sharpness slider up to decrease the feather on the built-in mask so you can really see the edges of the blur. Now I'll position the effect how I want it with the center and angle controls. I like this look, so I'll save it as a preset using the on-screen drop-down menu. Depth Blur is a great FX Factory Pro effect that allows you to easily create a tilt-shift look. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great effects, and if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at fxfactory.com.